Hi everybody, how are we all doing? It is Saturday the 25th of May 2013. Hope we're all having a fantastic weekend so far. I've been out in the sun, enjoying the weather, just been sunbathing for a bit, well, about a couple of hours. <laughs> it's, it's glorious weather here in Newcastle, so um, we're enjoying it and I hope you guys are having epic weather where you are as well. Okay, so before I um, get into the results of the competition, I just want to quickly mention something now. Last week's competition, um, where I um, asked everyone, you know, what, what was the issue of Action Comics that the cover that the kid is reading off in Superman the movie, what, what cover was it based on, what issue, and it was issue 12. Um, I read out four winners' names. However, I completely had no idea that it was actually seven people who, would actually, who actually got the answer correct. So the other three people have been contacted and they've all been given their relevant prizes, but because I need a winner, from last from that particular competition I've set I set those seven individuals five questions for them to answer they've all answered it correctly so because they've all answered it correctly I've put them into a little draw and um, I need to pick out the winner from that competition it's known as the tiebreaker as I've called it I call it the tiebreaker so uh, they've all, as I say all of them answered their questions correctly and the people who were in the list um, the, the seven names were Raymond Mitchell, Sean Goss, Roland Laurent, Brian McDonnell, Mitsos S, Stelios Cron, and Anthony Stewart. Okay, now I have actually picked the winner. Okay, of this particular competition. So the winner for this one is Roland Laurent. Okay, so you, my dear boy, have won that competition. So that puts you into the final draw. Okay, we'll explain that later on. Um, for that for that competition so well done to you Roland um, I know that you've sent me your address to send you the comic that I'm going to send you and I'm also going to send you obviously another prize um, in relation to to this particular um, competition that's just been done as well okay for the for the tiebreaker so you will be getting something extra special as well um, it is a surprise okay even the prize I'm going to give for this competition is going to be a surprise as well. I'm not going to reveal what it is, um, but it is, an, is a, it is a comic book, okay? But you're gonna you're gonna love what I'm going to send. Whoever whoever wins this, you're going to love it, okay? So now, this week's competition, which ended yesterday, um, the question that I asked was, who was the DC Comics writer that wrote into DC suggesting that Lex Luthor should be Superboy's uh, human? Uh, DNA of his clone as it were um, and everybody pretty much guessed right I got over 30 emails that came in and you all got it right it was none other than Jeffrey Johns otherwise known as Jeff Johns himself um, so well done to all of you okay that 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 was too easy way too easy so um, yeah <laughs> but well done to all of you but as I say only one winner can come out of it again winner has been picked Okay, get ready for the drum roll as the person who has been revealed as winning this prize is Jack Berry. Okay, Jack Berry, you have won this week's competition. Okay, uh, send me your address via email, and again, I will send you a lovely little surprise comic book as well. Don't worry, all these comic books that you're getting are all Superman related. Okay, because it's a Superman Man is still competition. What else am I going to send you? You know, I'm not going to send you something Batman related or Green Lantern, you know, related or Justice League. But hey, it's Superman. It's the Man of Steel. It's out June 14th, 2013. So we're we're almost there. We're almost there. But uh, so yeah, Jack Berry, Roland Lorenz, Well done to you guys. So Jack, if you send me your your address, as I say, I'll uh, get this out to you as soon as possible. Okay. Um, so now, <laughs> uh, before I get on to the next competition I just want to say there's going to be there's, there's been a bit of a change okay now the final competition this is actually the final competition okay so for, for this week until next Friday this is the last competition so next Saturday I'm going to collate all the winners of all the previous competitions put them together into one big prize draw okay um, this is going to contain some serious prizes I mean um, probably two or three okay two or three prizes I'm looking at here so um, again not going to tell you what they are just yet it's all going to be hush hush secret okay don't worry it's going to be epic you're going to love it okay um, it's going to put me out of flipping money is, <laughs> is what it's going to do but seriously you are going to love it okay so 
question. The, oh, well, no, sorry, not, not, not the question. Um, so yeah, that's what's going to happen. So this is the last, you know, overall competition. So you've got until next Friday for this competition. Okay, again, it is a question. All right. So the question for this week's competition, which is going to take place from today until next Friday, uh, when Richard Donner um, directed both Superman the movie and 80% of Superman 2, um, he used a particular word to describe his version of Superman and in terms of the movie that he was creating. I want you to tell me what that word is. Yeah, I, I cannot wait to see how you guys are going to get that question right because it's, it's a very interesting word. I'm not even going to give you any hints, but seriously, this is where your serious research is going to come into play. Okay, so Richard Donner described his version of Superman using what word? It's one word. Yeah, just you know, it's it it's it was his way of saying how he was going to make Superman truthful in terms of you know relatable, yes, but you know make him more human kind of thing. So there was what it was a particular word. It was a very interesting word. Um, so yeah, so good luck for that one. Um, so yeah, just to say the question one more time, because you know, no, sometimes you guys don't hear the question. What word did Richard Donner use to describe his version of Superman when he made Superman the movie and Superman 2? Okay, so there you go. Good luck. As I say, you got until next Friday, that's when the full competition ends, and then obviously Saturday I'll announce the winner, and then we'll kick off the big, big, big winners competition as i like to call it so that's that's the one that's going to really push everybody to, to the limits um so yeah thank you all for everybody who has entered congratulations to the winners so far um as i say roland you'll be getting your your your, your two prizes soon and uh, jack berry as i say email me with your address and i'll get something out to you guys as soon as possible i won't probably won't be able to send them until next weekend because it's good it's busy it's bank holiday weekend this weekend right now and i'm at work all all of next week so next Saturday is uh, is when I'm looking to uh, to get get things sent out to you guys okay um, so yeah thank you all for watching and this is usual very soon and again good luck bye